Hey guys, I've got a great weekend project for you. Made from nothing but scrap in the shop. Let me tell you where I got my design from and, and kind of walk you through how I built this. Um, the design is nothing new. However, I did kind of find it off Lumberjocks, and I wish I could remember the guy's name uh, on Lumberjocks. Um, but he came up with the design, I, I'm pretty sure, or he found it from somewhere else. But that's where I got it from. Uh, anyways, uh, I took a piece of hard maple, uh, just split it right down the middle. Um, same thing, and I, I cut out a piece of quarter-inch uh, walnut. Um, I glued them up, uh, let that dry over a period of time, and then I ran it through the uh, drum sander. And that was actually the first time I got to use my drum sander, which was pretty cool. After that, I sanded it down, um, and then I applied a, a, a nice chamfer to it um, for the base. And that's pretty much it for the base. Um, however, the, uh, the actual business card holder is kind of unique in itself. It's got this, this void space right here, as you can tell. Uh, and then it's sitting on about a 15-degree um, bevel. I think you can see better on this side. And what I did is I took a piece of, uh, of walnut and uh, did the same thing with the base. Ran it through the table saw, split it in half, um, cut out a piece of quarter inch hard maple, and then I just glued it up. And then I uh, went over to the router table and I installed a uh, three quarter inch straight bit and uh, ran that three or four times through the router table to get the correct depth. Um, after that, I took it over to the table saw. I cut my 45 degree miter, glued that up, let that dry for a little while, and then uh, I took it back over to the uh, table saw and uh, uh, ran it through the table saw with my miter gauge to get that 15 degree uh, bevel. Again, guys, a very, very simple project made from nothing but scraps. And uh, like I said, it was about four hours total time with the glue-ups and applying the tongue oil. Um, and the tongue oil took about two days to let it soak in. I let it 24 hours in between um, each coat. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to share this project with you guys, and uh, thanks for watching.